so this is what our code would look like. Uh, we would clean up our workspace and command window, so clear gets rid of all the variables. CLC will just clean up the command window. Close all will close open close any uh, plots that are open. So I'm going to set my values from x not to five. I have said what y1 is and I've said what y2 is. And then I'm just going to plot the results. So plot y1 against x and make it blue. Plot y2 against x and make it red. And then just label the axes and put a legend on it. So when I run that uh, script, that's the value I get. So this is what the, the plot would look like. And let's suppose I wanted to fill in the gaps in, in, in here. Okay. So yeah, something like that. I could use uh, the fill command. And if I go to MATLAB and look up what the fill command is, <coughs> it says uh, fill and gives me the X coordinates and the Y coordinates and the color. And you would think it's as simple as doing that. But the problem is the X coordinates start, say, let's say we're going to start on Y1. The X coordinates will say start here and then they'd go up till I get to, to this point here. And then when I went to, and I, we really want to go in that direction. So then I have to give the next X coordinate I give, she'll be this guy. <clears throat> but the X coordinates are going from 0 to 5. So if I want to use the fill command, I have to say it goes from 0 to 5, and then from 5 back down to 0. So I can use the flip left to right command for that. So let's say I have a vector x, and say that's 1 to 5. And if I want to read it back from 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, if I want to read it back this way, I can just go flip left to right, left to right of x. And then it flips it. Uh, alternatively, if I had x is equal to 1 to 5, and I transpose it. I could say flip uh, up down x and it just puts something the other way around. So this flip command can be useful in some MATLAB problems. So I want to add the fill command now to my script. So I put in my x values. So we're starting at x, so these are the this is where we're gonna go from naught to five, and then we're gonna go from five back down to naught for uh, the second um, the second line. And similarly we're gonna go whatever the y values are, and then we use the flip version of the, the y values for the second line. So when I run this command, I've set the fill colors to be uh, cyan. So when I run it I have filled between two lines. <coughs>